One of the things I love about Elimination Chamber is that it's a different match every few minutes when another pod opens and another superstar enters the mix. If I'm starting the match, I'm trying to inflict as much punishment as I can in a one-on-one -on -one scenario. A quick win gives you some time to rest before the next pod opens. Early eliminations are one thing, Corey, but you also need to conserve strength to be the last superstar standing. Yeah, Corey, it's very simple. The more people you have in the ring at one time, the less chance you have of becoming victorious. Solid strategy, if you can pull it off. Ow! Really just laying it in. Uh-oh, she can be set up for a submission here. The Achilles lock. I think it's over, Michael. Perhaps thinking something else here. Not sure why, though, Michael. She seemed to have it really cinched in. Yeah, double arm lock, so Things taking a turn for her now. She can still turn it around by taking this fight wherever she wants it. From the middle rope, big miss right there. She's not wasting any time getting to the ring. She's ready to go. Would you look at this? She is removing the turnbuckle pad now. Morgan on the receiving end. And she doesn't connect. Oh, she has bad intentions now. Removing the turnbuckle pad. Corey, what's in a competitor's mind when battling inside this mammoth structure? Adapting to their surroundings. They're surveying the chamber to find out just how they'll annihilate their opponents. Look at how the action is breaking down. Know who is in the ring and who is coming out of the box. You have to be ready for anything. You have to fight for your life. Well, this is not the environment to succumb to the ennui and despair. It's time to fight for survival or suffer elimination. This is her time to shine, and don't you forget it. Forced out of the ring, and now she's looking to go top rope. Taking flight. Look at the floor. And that was a collision you don't want to be on the receiving end of. Came down like a wrecking ball on a cinder block. Re-entering the ring now. So take things into the ring. Now, can she keep her down? Gets the shoulder. She's still as determined as ever. Into the turnbuckle. Looking vulnerable on that top turnbuckle. Oh, oh no, this is going to end it for sure. Going to the closet from the top. Such an underhanded tactic there. Kick lands. Oh, cross avoids contact.
submission. I don't know if it's Mercy or if it's someone who's not done playing with their prey. She covers for the pin. Ooh, look at her answering back. Two. Forces the shoulder up after two. Both competitors digging deep into their well to keep this match going. to muster from behind. Ow, oh, Elytra was down. This could be the one that does it for him. Oh, and a kick out. How in the world? She kicked out. No way. She actually kicked out. Counter and counter. Oh, wow. Wow. Straight to the back. Big Gonzalez in her clutches. is getting pushed beyond the normal limits. Cover! One, I don't think two, any of these superstars are going to show up. Kennedy Gonzalez has been eliminated. Attitude on full display. She was just looking to soften her up a little there. And Lynn landing some urgently needed offense there. Oscar, uh oh, Oscar's out of position. It's cinched in. She was looking highly motivated, getting hyped up. Oh man, she had to tap out. What a win! And Nikki, was Nikki Cross has been eliminated. To this guy's no 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 you're insane you're insane what a pinpoint landing from the top of the pod picture perfect The WWE Universe celebrating this match and the winner. With that win, they deserve the praise. You could just sense the intensity in the air throughout this one. Yeah, this win was well earned.